What a beautiful day to take a walk outside. It might be the best day we get all week. Let's get over to Elise for all the details in our forecast. Hey, Mary, I have to agree. I do think this is going to be the pick of the week. We match the sunshine with the warmth. Tomorrow we'll have even warmer temperatures, but we may not see skies quite like this. So while we started out with cloudy skies today, things are obviously looking good this noon uh, in and around the tri-state area for New York City. We're mostly sunny. We're at 54 degrees, so already warmer right now than it was all day yesterday. Pollen is an issue, especially tree pollen. If that is a trigger for you as an allergy sufferer, it might be a little rough today. Tree pollen is high. Fortunately, grass, ragweed, mold, and weeds are all low today. As we take a look at temperatures, well, you can see we're in the 50s across the tri-state area. 54 from Monticello, White Plains, Poughkeepsie. 55 for the Hamptons and Sparta. 57 for Edison and for Greenwich. So those are the two warmest locations. And these numbers represent a warm-up over this time yesterday. It's uh, four degrees warmer for White Plains. Five degrees for New York City, Brick, and the Hamptons. It's already 11 degrees warmer in Edison right now than it was this time yesterday. So we're definitely off to a really good start. We were stuck in the 50s on Sunday, and of course, yesterday only at 51 degrees. 63, the forecast high for today, 67 for tomorrow, but I don't think we'll see as much sunshine uh, tomorrow afternoon before temperatures take a tumble on Thursday and Friday. Your Skycast satellite and radar is fairly quiet this noon, which is nice. So remember, we did have quite a bit of cloud cover. For those of you who were up with us dark and early, as I like to call it, uh, we had a little bit of residual rain and certainly quite a bit of cloud cover. But little by little, we've been seeing a decrease in cloud cover throughout the day. We'll see uh, more of it this afternoon, but it doesn't last long. So turning on your future cast, you can see we have a nice afternoon and evening. But as we head into the day tomorrow, we will start to see an increase in cloud cover. This particular model is looking a little bit better than earlier runs, so maybe not quite as much cloud cover. But we do have at least a slight chance to see some showers tomorrow evening, around about a 30% chance that we'll see some rain on Wednesday. It is on Thursday that we are expecting a significant soaking. So you can see quite a bit of rain, heavy at times. That's going to take us throughout the day on Thursday. So Thursday's a soggy day. Even Friday, as this system wraps up, we're likely to see a little bit of snow out of this system. As far as how much rain we could get when it's all said and done, little over an inch to a little over two inches for some locations. And some locations could pick up an inch of snow, potentially. Other models are saying, yeah, don't, don't count on it. Still, we are going to see a soggy end to the work week. So today is looking great, mostly sunny, 63 this afternoon. Tomorrow, 67 with a chance for more clouds, a little bit of rain, and then soggy for your Thursday and Friday. Mary? Elise, thank you. We'll